speaking of women in sports, Thursday is baseball's opening day, and boy, have we got the perfect guest here to celebrate Tiki! <laughs> she is a former pro baseball player who played in the All-American Girls Baseball League, the real-life league that inspired the phenomenal film, A League of Their Own. Please welcome an ace pitcher from Southern California, Mabel Blair! <laughs> Hey, Maybelle, how are you? Oh, God, the old girl couldn't be better, Kiki. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. All right, Maybelle, tomorrow is opening day. Who are you going to be watching? Oh, my God, every ball game I can watch. But my <laughs> Dodgers and my Angels, my Red Sox, and now with the uh, Florida Marlins on account of uh, uh, Kim Ming, yes. his first woman general manager. Can you believe that? That shows the advancement of women in professional sports. We're seeing professional uh, football teams have women coaches, yeah. right? So we know that it's changing slowly but surely. It started because of you, That's Maybelle. Right. Yeah, can you believe that? This old 94-year-old girl helped a little bit. Not much. <laughs> But, Maybe. oh, my God, I, I'm so excited what's happening. Mabel, I have a question for you, which is you're young. It's in the 1940s. Obviously, there's, you know, a, a, a very different time for women. What is a good tip for young people today to hook into their passion? The main thing to, today is to get out there and do your darndest because it is going to happen, Drew. We are going to open up. We're going to do our... We're going to get a new league. In fact, we're working on it now. Uh, we're trying to get our own museum going. And uh, it's happening. And if you love it, follow it. Because look at Tiki sitting there. He probably didn't think he was going to play professional football, but he did. And look what he did. And us girls can do the same thing. And we're so excited. <laughs> That is so true, Mabel. I have four daughters. I don't want them to be limited by anything. So absolutely, you're an inspiration, Maybell. Thank you yeah, so much you for being you. I mean, seriously, you started something profound and it's we're still feeling it. Yeah, absolutely. Oh my God, I'm so thrilled. Uh, it has opened up college sports and everything. Now the uh, WNBA and I'm so proud of those girls. They're doing their thing, and uh, girls are getting scholarships. Baseball is finally opening their eyes that we can play baseball. So let us have an opportunity to play it. Let these girls have that. That's what I'm working for while I'm on this side of the grass. Well, and all the data in the world says that young girls who get involved in sports mm -hmm. just have a better shot at, like, quality focus, you know, lovely friendships. It's just educational opportunities, scholarships, all those things. You're yes. absolutely right, Drew. Thank you, Maybell, for showing, especially in the 1940s, what was possible. And please go to our show website and find out how you can support women in baseball and Maybell's museum. Oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And you were a Peoria Red Wing. In fact, Mabel, we have a clock here dedicated to Peoria, Illinois, and our affiliate station, WMBD. Oh, how wonderful. Well, you can't beat that. You can't. And you can't beat you, Mabel. Thank you so much for coming on the show today.